Hi YouTubers, this is the Harbor Freight winch. Here is the wiring and you can see it right here and I'll turn it on in a second. Now this goes up to a 40 amp circuit breaker. I offset the hole a little bit and this is just for a test with 14 gauge fusible linkage. And you come up here and I have a quick connect right here as you can see. This comes apart right here. Uh, it turns and then connects in there. That goes under the hood. So all you have to do is connect that. And then you come down here and then in order to test this, this is grounded, the center one. And this is there. That's one direction and that's the other direction. And it works just fine. Uh, oops, I could have been off, but anyway, there. That is the motor working. No problems, and this particular brand here, there's a lot of problems with the wiring, but this is wire right here is the negative. You can see the negative, and you can, and then you can follow the positive wire to there. I'm going to disconnect the circuit and then M2 goes up here on this side and M1 is this one right here and so that makes it pretty easy to figure out and this center here is grounded to the battery ground and all I did is connect the positive to activate either side either direction and that's pretty much what the Harbor Freight winch with this other solenoid that's a screw type and the uh, the wireless I forgot the name of it uh, I'll type that in it, I believe it's L-I-E-B-M-A-Y-A -A wireless um, I didn't see that always with it but very good hope you guys have a good time wiring it up and it sure does work right and won't blow up that way